What's this, Henry? My new venture. Dreamt it up when I was in detention. Imagine never having to worry about your homework again. Well, now you can. Now you can what? Imagine never having to worry about your homework again. Obviously. The Uber Homework app. We've got it covered. Cool. Who's making the app? You are. I am? Yeah. Won't take you long, will it? Well... They don't call you Brainy Brian for nothing. It's only you that calls me Brainy Brian. Yeah, well, that's because you're brainy. Even if Brian can do it. Have you thought about who's going to actually do the homework, Henry? Oh, don't worry about that. I know just the person. Mum, I'm home! Hello, honey bun. Rolly, 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 rolly. Oh, what you doing? Oh, uh, just some homework. You're doing homework? Yes. Why? Don't you know. Know what? About the extra good as gold star scheme. The one where you get extra gold stars if you say pretty please and three times thank you. Nope. The one where you get extra gold stars if you shine some shoes and dust some dirt. Nope, not that one. Gosh. Well, then, no. I don't think I know about any more. Oh, so you don't know about the one where you get extra gold stars if you do extra homework? Wait, is this a trick? Because that doesn't sound like a Miss Lovely extra good as gold stars scheme. It does if you do the homework without being asked. Oh, I wonder why I don't know about that one. Because it's top secret. Only really special people get to do it. But I'm special. Aren't I? Maybe. Depends. On what? On whether you do the homework without being asked. Tea time, boys. You haven't done any homework yet. Ah, but I'm about to. Look, pencil poised. Here I go. I'm doing it. So easy being me. I'm Yeah. Go you, Ralph. Ah, oh, what's the matter? Lost my lucky thing. Whoa, that's bad. What happened? Mum threw it away. Whoa, that's bad. How come? What's up, everyone? Henry lost his lucky thing. I didn't lose it. Mum threw it away. Henry's lost his lucky thing. <laughs> Henry's lost his lucky thing. Oh, dear. I lost a lucky thing once. Henry's lost his lucky thing. My dad says it's all just superstition. There's no such thing as luck. There you go, Henry. If Brian's dad says there's no such thing, then you're going to be fine. But I'm not. Fine, that is. Yesterday morning, everything was fine. I got a lion, Mum made pancakes, I watched a whole hour of gross class zero. <laughs> lucky, lucky, lucky. But then Mum threw away my lucky thing. Not lucky. And now my life is ruined. <laughs> Attention! You're it, boy. That was a long detention. Thought you'd be out by break time. Yeah, well, I guess it's just not my lucky day. What's that? It's all our lucky things. We had a whip round. Take your pick, Henry. Oh, no, I can't take your lucky things. Oh, come on, Henry. I'll get you some lunch. Cheer up, Henry. Lucky is as lucky does, as my mum always says. What does that mean? I don't know. It's stew. It's stew every day, Henry. Yeah, but there's stew and there's stew. And this is stew. Hey, Snot Brain! Oh, what do you want, Margaret? Ooh, hoity toity! Heard you lost your lucky thing. Yeah, I did. Well, that was unlucky, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, unlucky. I should be so unlucky, unlucky, unlucky. <sighs> Girls, eh? Yeah. I don't know. You coming, Henry? <sighs> Wonder how much more unlucky I'm going to get today. 
I don't know. Clear that up now, you horrid boy. And so the Poppy Princess said to the Cucumber King, If you can help me to cross the tomato torrent, then I can help you pick up the lazy lettuces. And the Cucumber King said... It's so easy being me, I'm Horrid Henry! <laughs> <laughs> here first. No, you weren't. I was here first, in spirit. Oi! I need to clean my teeth. Well, I need to clean my teeth too. I need the toothpaste. Yes, worm, and I need the toothpaste too. I need it more than you and don't call me worm. No, you don't. My teeth are bigger than yours. So is your head. What did you say? And anyway, you haven't had your breakfast yet. That's true. There, all done. <laughs> Morning, worm. Don't be horrid, Henry. Morning, Henry. Finishing off your homework, honey bun? Oh, no, I did all my homework last night. I'm doing some extra number gnomes colour work. Oh, well done, Peter. Henry! Don't be horrid, Henry. Yes, don't be horrid, Henry. What? Oh, just getting the cereal. Well, you can just get the cereal more carefully, can't you? I suppose. Henry! Right, that's it, Henry. Go and brush your teeth. But I've brushed my teeth already. Well, go and do something useful then. OK. I've been meaning to sort out my snot slimers for a while. I guess now will be a good time to do it. Henry! Henry. You're no match for me, whoever you are. Sign a selfie. It's OK. She's run out of batteries. Hey, I was watching that! Quiet time now, Henry. You know that. No, I don't. What's quiet time when it's at home? It's when we spend some quiet time together before going up the wooden stairs to Bedfordshire. Oh, how are we even related? Can't I watch TV quietly? Gross Class Zero isn't quiet. No, it's not. Then can I watch something else? Something educational? Something like, go for your greens? Well, I did read something the other day that said that watching TV isn't really all that bad for you. It's so easy being me, I'm Henry. And with one whisk of the wand, he was gone. Vanished into thin air. What is it, Worm? Uh, nothing. And don't call me Worm. Then why are you standing at the door waving that thing at me? It's not a thing, it's a magic wand. It's pink. So? And fluffy. Yes, it is. It's pink and fluffy. And it's my magic wand. Well... Miss Lovely's, really, but she's lent it to me for the weekend and... Let's have a closer look at it. <laughs> now that's what I call magic. <laughs> no! Cool. That worked. Big strategy meeting tonight. Thanks for being the guinea pig, Worm. <laughs> Hello, sweetie bun. Yes. Going out to join the boys? Yes. Oh, that's nice, dear. 
What's the matter, Fluffy Wuffy? Did the thunder frighten you? I think it's going to rain. Sorry I'm late. Just missed the rain. Oh, is it fancy dress? Eh? I am the Merry Magician. Are you now? Well, I like to get up. Is that velvet? Are you open to magicers, Peter? What do you think? I don't know. I like a bit of magic, I do. Oh, I don't know if I like magic. Do I or don't I? Oh, oh dear. These carrots are magic. Now you see it? <laughs> no, they don't. <laughs> Not sure that's the kind of magic he's talking about, are you? You were saying, Henry? Huh? Ooh, what was I saying? You were going to say something horrid to Peter! <laughs> was I? Well, I don't think I was. Come and sit next to me, Peter. Come on, you can help us plan the raid on old Bogey Brain next door. Have a biscuit, Peter. So easy being me, I'm I just don't see why we need a new one. Well, you see... Henry! Well, you see nothing. We don't need a new one, and that's that. But... No buts! <sighs> Do you have any idea where my mobile phone is? Oh, uh, where did you have it last? Oh, for goodness sake. If I knew where I had it last, then I'd know where it is, wouldn't I? Shh. What's going on? They're having one of their arguments. Oh, that's not an argument. That's a discussion. Whatever it is, we're not getting a new one. Well, that's probably because we don't need a new one. Don't need a new what? Whatever it is they're discussing. Oh, welcome to my life. <gasps> Whoa, forgot my good as gold book. Henry! Yes, Mum? Oh, there you are. Looking for your mobile phone, Mum? Oh, yes. Thank you, Henry. Now, what have I done with the car keys? Oh, honestly, I'd forget my head if it wasn't on top of my shoulders. See you later. Don't forget me, Mum! Dad, can I stay home today? I'm not feeling... Yes, of course, Henry. No problem. Yes! Don't you have to go to work today, Dad? Uh, no, not today. I've, uh, got a late meeting. Oh, OK, cool. Time for a snack, I reckon. Uh, Fancy a snack, Fang? Yeah, yeah, yeah. OK, thank you. I'll get the old one. <gasps> the old what, Dad? What are you doing here, Henry? You said I could stay home, remember? Did I? Yes, cos... <laughs> I'm not feeling very... Go back up to your room, then. But I need a... If you're not well, Henry, you need to be in bed. But I'm hungry. Are you going to answer that? <sighs> Just don't tell your mother. I won't. It's so easy being me. I'm Henry. Once upon a time, in a far, far away place, someone dreamed a dream. Oh. They're watching a movie. I bet it's a soppy movie. Henry's not allowed to watch soppy movies on the computer. I should tell Mum, really. Though, I suppose it's Brian's computer, so maybe it doesn't count. But then he's actually watching it, so... What do you think? To tell or not to tell? That is the question. Mum! <laughs> Henry! Hey! Oh, sorry, Henry's mum. No! <laughs> Greetings all! Hands up who saw to the back of beyond and beyond! I think it was really good. <laughs> it was really good. Like it, Bert? I don't know. You got caught, didn't you? Yep. My wormy worm little brother thought we were watching soppy movies. To the back of beyond and beyond's not a 
the soppy movie? I know that, and you know that, William. But my worm of a brother doesn't know that. Neither does your mum, by the sound of it. You should have come round to mine. We've got stereo surround up and down, sound and triplicate with marshmallows and hot chocolate on tap. It's in there. What's in there? I don't know. The 3D nouveau fangled printer that's in the movie. The one that replicates all the moon monsters so they can win the marching contest. That's the one. And? And I'm going to make one. Well, that's cool. That's very cool. What's very cool? None of your business, Snotslime. Not you, that's for certain. What do you mean, not you? It's not you that's very cool, that's for sure. I didn't say it was very cool. Did I? No, don't think you said that. I don't know. Why is it impossible to have a normal conversation with a boy, especially horrid ones? Come on, Susan! Do you really think you can do it, Brian? Watch this bit. So easy being me, I'm Henry. Oh, yes! Yes! Me, 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 me. Oh. Optimen Wincat. What does that mean? May the best person win. Reckon you'd be good for that, Henry. No, I wouldn't. What are you talking about, anyway? The election. Election? What election? The one to be on the school council. The one that's going to be fair and equal, <laughs> I don't think. <laughs> Who'd want to be on the school council, anyway? I would love to be on school council. Yes, just think of all the extra special things you could get done. You could introduce a tidy up day. A day of good deeds. Or bring all your colouring pencils to school so you can swap them with your best friend's day. Oh, how I would love to be on school council. <laughs> there you go, Henry. Think of all the extra special things you could get done. How about no school for a year? <laughs> if they mean what they say, this could be a real opportunity, Henry. But why me? Why do you think I should do it? Because everyone will vote for you. <laughs> well, I don't think so. Anyway, I've got more important things to think about. Like what, Henry? Like stuck-up Steve. He's coming to stay with us because Rich Aunt Ruby's got some conference she has to go to and apparently there's no one to look after him. Good luck with that then, Henry. You mean good luck with that everyone? He's coming into school tomorrow because Mum and Dad are at work. <laughs> And then I was elected as captain of the Fiverside Tiddlywinks team. Ooh, that sounds exciting. Morning, Henry. Mm. Oh, yeah, it is very exciting. Almost as exciting as being leader of the Free World Society. And what's that when it's at home? Don't be horrid, Henry. Ooh, ooh, we're having elections at our school. Are you now? Yes, we are, and I'm really hoping that they'll pick me. Sweetie, if it's an election, they'll be voting for you. It takes courage, confidence and nerves of steel to be a winner, Peter. And a good-as-gold book that's full of good-as-gold stars. <laughs> that's not how it works, Peter. OK, y'all, so at my school we get a head start if your parents are very, very rich. Or if you've got three houses, one of which is a castle. Well, how's that fair? Oh, it's 